Hey guys, welcome back. I hope everyone's having a fabulous start to their November. In today's video, I thought we would do a little clean and decorate with me. I'm starting off by putting away my Halloween tree and I'm a little sad because without it, it kind of looks really bare in my living room right now. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but for the most part, I think I'm gonna wait to put up my Christmas tree until like Thanksgiving because I just figured that'd be something me and my hubby could do together. Um, but right now it's going to look a little bit bare and empty. Um, but I guess that's okay. But yeah, I'm just starting by putting away my black Christmas tree. Then I want to tackle my dining room area because my dining room area is still all decorated um, for Halloween. So I want to tackle that today. And I also want to update you on some touches I did in the kitchen so you guys can check out some of the fall decor in there as well. So I'm really excited for this video. Let's jump into it. This is basically how the table is set for now. I did find my thankful, grateful, and blessed chargers that I use usually on Thanksgiving. So I decided to put them out. Why not as decor? Um, but I do plan on getting some dry floral arrangements, maybe even a garland at Hobby Lobby this weekend. But I think this works for now. I think it's really cute and it's good to have a fresh start. Heading over to the kitchen, I wanted to show you guys this cozy little area. I decided to add a small little lamp that I was no longer using in my bedroom over here in this corner. And honestly, you guys, the mood completely changed. It got a lot more cozy when... I did this so I highly recommend that if you guys are looking for like a more cozy setting especially at night if you're someone who likes to come downstairs or go to the kitchen to get like a drink of water or something at night this little lamp is like the perfect like ambient lighting to kind of like you know have that cozy chill mood and I absolutely love how it looks I also added this little Mickey head charcuterie board and this sign that says hey pumpkin and my 
my pumpkin mug. And as you can see, I am trying to get these god-awful <laughs> uh, bats off of my tile. I'm really having an issue. So I did order something called Gugon on Amazon after this video was shot to just try out. I'm hoping it helps remove these a little bit easier because I do have some left still on the walls in my mudroom. I'll update you guys in my next video to let you know how well it works. But yeah, so just working on removing these bats. This is another little area in my kitchen. It's actually on the other side of my stove. So both sides of my stoves are decorated with these leaves as well as this little pumpkin sign. I also added this adorable LED tree next to my sink. Lastly, I wanted to show you guys a pan over of my coffee table. And that is it you guys for now at least. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you again next time. Bye.